All right, so there is a slight variation to the if statement that we're gonna cover here, and that's called the switch statement. Now you might not use these often, but they are a more flexible and sometimes cleaner solution when your if statements are potentially gonna get a little bit messy. So let's take a look at how this looks and then we'll build up a kind of real world uh, example of this. So this is a switch statement. Notice it's pretty similar to an if statement where instead of if we just use switch. Now inside of this, this isn't a block that's going to be run uh, if this evaluates to true. What we're basically doing is we're taking a value into here and then in here we set a series of cases where we do something if these match. So in this case, we're gonna say case one. Well, if that's the case, we wanna run something here and then down here we want to break. So this might seem a little bit odd, but let's go ahead and test this out. So we're gonna echo out here the value is one. So if what we pass in is one, so this is the kind of condition, then we echo this out and then we break. Now, what we can also do is set a default, but we'll take a look at this in the browser and then we'll have a look at that as well. Let's give that a refresh and we know the value is one. Now, if the value is two, none of these cases will be met because we only have one in there and we don't see anything. But that is where our default case comes in where we can do something here and we can go ahead and break if this isn't met. So it's kind of like an else within an if else statement. So the value is unknown, for example. Let's give that a refresh. The value is unknown because it doesn't match this case. So of course, what we can do is go ahead and duplicate this down and have case two. The value is two. And as you will have guessed, we get that out because the value that we've passed in is two. And again, if we choose three, the value is unknown. Now, what we can also do is use comparison operators in these. So let's take a look at a kind of real world example of what we might want to do. Now, let's say the weather that we get from anywhere is currently sunny. And what we're gonna do is set a color to a default of null. And based on the weather, we're gonna set a color that maybe we want to display to represent the weather. So in this case, an if statement would be a little bit messy because we would have to do if, else if, else, whatever. So we're gonna say switch, and this time we're gonna do something a little bit different. We're gonna say switch true. That might seem really weird, but what we're doing here is we're saying we're passing in a true value. So all of these conditions or cases will be attempted to be evaluated. So in here, I'm gonna say case weather, which is a variable we're using outside of here, is equal to sunny, then we want to do something in here. So we're gonna break this, and then in here, we're gonna say, well, if it's sunny, maybe we should set the color here to blue that we've uh, defined as a null up there. And we've already looked at null as well. Okay, so now if the weather is cloudy, maybe we want to set the color to gray. And then down here, once again, we break that. Now you can add a default in here, I'm not going to, but we can kind of get the idea from this example. Now we can echo out the color and we should see the color depending on what we've chosen for the weather. So now when I refresh, we see blue. If I change this over to cloudy, we see gray, brilliant. So the way that we've set this up is quite common if we have a more complex way to check things rather than using an if statement, which can start to look a little bit messy. This is a little bit easier to read. So that is why we've done that. Okay, so that's all we're gonna cover for switch. That is pretty much it. You won't always need to use it, but like I said, uh, these things start to get a little bit messy if you are using if statements. And at least if you see this now, you'll recognize the syntax and you'll know why it's being used.